Good evening and welcome to the 2023 District 7 American Advertising Awards. I'm Jeff Harrison and I'm the governor of AAF District 7. AAF District 7 includes Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia, Tennessee, and Southeast Louisiana. We're excited to share some wonderful work from across our district with you tonight. But first, I'd like to introduce two other members of the executive team. Hi everyone, my name is Sarah Jones and I am proud to serve as the chair of the District 7 American Advertising Awards this year, as well as on the Eastern Region Executive Committee for AAF. We were so impressed by all of the entries this year and cannot wait to announce our winners. Hi everyone, my name is Michelle Clark Payne and I am the co-chair for the District 7 American Advertising Awards and also your district representative to the National Awards Committee. Before we share the first set of winning work, we'd like to say a special thank you to our judges. We assembled a talented judging panel from across the nation and our industry this year. A panel of three student judges and seven professional judges reviewed all of this year's entries. These judges spent a tremendous amount of time reviewing all of the submitted work, so please join us in thanking them for their time. To kick off tonight's show, let's take a look at the impressive student work from across the district. Gold Addy Award goes to Bella Pace from the Watkins College of Art and Design at Belmont University for Cryptids Are Real. Maddie Seal from the University of Southern Mississippi wins a Gold Addy Award for Advisor 2022 Planner. A gold daddy goes to Mason Joyner from the Miami Ad School of Ideas for Awareness Beneath Your Feet. Also from the Miami Ad School of Ideas, Olivia Wagner, Andrew Perez, and Justin Acala win a gold daddy for Toilet Chronicles. In the 1970s, newspapers, magazines, and novels were commonplace. Over 60% of us read print daily. But in 2022, print has been forsaken for the convenience of audiobooks, e-readers, and social media. Now, only 12% of us read print daily. But... Do you know what we do do daily? Do do. The average person spends 75 hours a year on the toilet. The same amount of time it takes to read 10 400 page books. So, for National Reading Month, we made reading print a daily routine by turning bathroom time into reading time. Introducing. Toilet Chronicles, the top 75 penguin classics printed on Charmin's toilet paper. We use soy-based ink that's eco-friendly and two-ply paper that's bum-friendly. To roll out the campaign, we teepeed the house of the villain of print, Dawn Cass. We turned toilet paper aisles into libraries and libraries into toilet paper aisles. To reach the everyday dumper, we placed our chronicles in public restrooms. They were available online at Penguin, Charmin, and Amazon. To measure literacy rate, we offered post-wipe quizzes for our readers. If they passed, they got their next chronicle for free. Toilet Chronicles. Strong minds, soft bottoms. A gold daddy goes to Lexi Casper from Tulane University for Mezzo. Mihak Talavia from the Savannah College of Art and Design wins a gold daddy for Elevest, invest like a woman. Ladies, it's time to shut a few things down. The wage gap, thigh gap, the investment gap. Don't know that one? It's that thing where women aren't getting their fair share because the investment industry and almost all its tools are built for men by men. Yeah, that's a thing. 
It means even if you're doing everything right, planning for the future, saving for what matters, kicking butt and getting yours, you're still getting less because the system isn't built for the realities of being you. Realities like you live longer, your salary may peak sooner, and things like career breaks, smaller raises, and the fact that your financial advisor has an 86% chance of looking like this could cost you hundreds of thousands of dollars or more over your lifespan. Enough. We are on a mission to fix it. We are Elevest, the first investment platform designed to help this half of the population meet their financial goals. It's built for women, designed by women. That means we get ours, for real this time. Financial independence, financial equality, financial power. Because being in control of our money is power. What will you do with yours? Elevest, invest like a woman. Connor Gaeta from Jacksonville State University wins a gold daddy for the Satchel Font Design. Connor Gaeta wins another gold daddy for Waverly Font Design. Tara Holbrooks from Jacksonville State University wins a gold daddy for Stay Fresh, Infographic and Products. Abby Vignelli from Torrey University wins a gold daddy for The King in Disguise. Eric Dawson from Nashville State Community College wins a gold daddy for In His Study. From Louisiana State University, Katie McVeigh wins a gold daddy for Beyond the Surface. A gold daddy goes to Christina Rush from Nashville State Community College for Story Bigger Than Me. Abby Vignelli from Troy University wins another gold daddy for the King in Disguise. A gold daddy goes to Victoria Miller from Middle Tennessee State University for Socialite Nerdy Girls. Mihek Talavia from Savannah College of Art and Design wins another gold daddy for the Elevest Invest Like a Woman. Being in control of our money is power. What will you do with yours? Elevest. Invest like a woman. Rebecca Briscoe from Tulane University wins a gold daddy for Hidden Fortune Title Sequence. Oh, Escobar simply just buried a ton of money all over Colombia, whether he owned the land or not. just found 600 million buried on his property. Also from Tulane University, a gold daddy goes to Becky Gibson for Little Sax title sequence.
Connor Gaeta from Jacksonville State University wins a Gold Addy for Apex Graphics Package. A team from Middle Tennessee University, Peter Wynn, Daisy Gonzalez, Savannah Harper, Kate Sproles, Michael McGee, Alyssa Vu, Jamisa Coleman, and Jackson Taylor win a Gold Addy for Image Activated Library Letters. Congratulations to the student Gold Addy winners. And now for the student Silver Addy winners. Congratulations to all of the student winners. Congratulations to all of the gold and silver Addy winners. Every year we are so impressed by the quality of the student work. There's an amazing pool of talent across our district. And now we're excited to announce the special awards in the student categories. We'll begin with our three Judges' Choice Awards. The first Judges' Choice Award goes to Sarah De Silva from Savannah College of Art and Design for Generac The Outage Campaign. This is this has been a terrible nightmare. We also asked each judge to share a note about why they made their selection. Let's see what the judge had to say about this campaign. The second Student Judges' Choice Award goes to Aaron Brown, Morgan Egan, Matthias Meyer, and Miles Netto from the University of Alabama for the Backbone Awards. In 2018, you, the One Club, released a brief asking students to make sure that momentum is never lost in the fight against gun violence. In your brief, you pinpoint cultural glorification of violence as a major contributory issue to what you then called America's gun violence epidemic. Four years and 74,735 deaths from gun violence later, you're asking students to make Call of Duty Warzone celebrated by mainstream culture. This isn't about whether or not video games cause gun violence. This is about the One Club. You would think the gold standard in advertising would understand the importance of a consistent brand message. Instead, you're flipping your principles faster than the coins you're chasing. Thankfully, this spinelessness doesn't represent advertising as a whole. As students hoping to break into the industry, we're seeking out examples that stand tall. We're doing what the One Club wouldn't. Recognizing leaders in advertising who start difficult conversations and speak up for those who are too often left unheard. And that's why we've created the first ever Backbone Awards. Visit our website to see the nominees, what they stand for, and cast your vote. 
This is our reminder to the industry. If you want work that makes an impact, it had better be for the right reasons. We might be students, but we'll never be sellouts. And our last Student Judges' Choice Award goes to Emma Gubitz from Savannah College of Art and Design for NYX Period Underwear. Listen, I'm just gonna come out and say it. What you did to me was totally f***ed up. I knew you'd think I'm crazy for holding on to this since high school. <sighs> I still remember the way you said you'd be there for me. Holding my hand, making sure that when I walked up on stage for graduation that my silk white slip dress would leave the crowd shook. But you stained that. Oh boy, you didn't just leave a big fat red mark on my ass. You left one on my heart. Are we just gonna sit here and act like we don't need to talk about this? Okay, you're really gonna make me relive this right now? Fine, let's go there. If convincing my roommates to host the Halloween after wasn't hard enough, how about ruining our matching costumes? These sexy ghost costumes took three days of cutting and bedazzling. Don't look at me like that, as if you haven't done a Scandi Halloween costume. Anyways, you came upstairs with me so I could touch up my glitter, I got some in my nose, and I sneezed. <laughs> you were so weak. It only took one sneeze for you to turn my beautiful, white, sexy moment into a bloody murder scene. You knew I wasn't going for scary, and you ruined that for me. What? Is confrontation too spooky for you? This memory has stained my life. I wish I could charge you the rent for the space it occupies in my head. I still think about him, my first real crush, Adam Frankelson, who sat me on his perfectly white bed and told me he only sleeps in white linen because it regulates his body temperature. <sighs> it was the sexiest and sweetest thing a man has ever said. And because of you, our first date, well, study sesh, was completely soiled. I stood up and boom, the perfectly tidy, always on time Adam Frankelson was witness to what looked like a crime scene on his duvet. Of course, the angel of the human being told me it was totally fine, but those linen sheets? Yeah, guess who got the receipt for the dry cleaning bill? Emailed to me the next day. Wanna explain to me how you plan on healing this trauma? Congratulations to all of the Judges' Choice winners. And now we present our category winners. This year's overall Best of Print Award goes to Bella Pace from Watkins College of Art and Design at Belmont University for Cryptids Are Real. The overall Best of Digital Award goes to a team from Middle Tennessee State University for Image Activated Library Letters. Our last special award for the evening is the overall Best of Show in the Student Division. Please join me in congratulating Victoria Miller from Middle Tennessee State University for her work, Socialite Nerdy Girls.
Congratulations again to all of the student winners. And now, we'll take a look at the first set of winning entries in the professional division. Finn Partners from Nashville wins two Gold Addy Awards for Jack Daniels 21 Distillery Report. Done for the Jack Daniels Distillery. A Gold Addy Award goes to Scarlet Pearl Casino Resort from Mississippi Gulf Coast for the 2022 Halloween Dinner Invitation. Lewis Communications in Birmingham wins a Gold Addy Award for Two Rivers Direct Mail, done for Two Rivers. Finn Partners from Nashville wins two Gold Addy Awards for Jack Daniels Bonded Series Kit. Done for Jack Daniels Distillery. Fitzco in Atlanta wins three Gold Addy Awards for French's Mustard Donuts, done for French's. Mark your calendar. Saturday is National Mustard Day, hence the yellow robe. Mustard donuts. Mustard donuts. Mustard donuts. One of the biggest names in condiments has teamed up with Dough Donuts to release a limited edition French's Mustard Donut. It's happening at different dough locations around New York City. You can visit Doe's website tomorrow morning. Reserve a complimentary order available for nationwide shipping. The guys love them, so try them. Chemistry Agency from Atlanta wins a Gold Addy Award for Spirit of 17, done for Atlanta United. Regal Cinemas in Knoxville wins a Gold Addy for Jurassic World Lobby Experience. The best place to watch a movie requires cutting-edge technology. As fans enter our front doors, they emerge into a truly immersive digital lobby space. For Jurassic World Dominion, 
We worked with Universal Pictures to leverage their IP in unique and clever ways. Our goal is to create special moments with engaging content that guests can discover as they move throughout our lobbies. Our design team created over 140 pieces of content to maximize the impact of each unique digital lobby installation. Creating these special movie-going moments for our guests is a great way for Regal to introduce the magic of the movies to a whole new generation of fans. From Memphis, Speak Creative wins a gold addy for Memphis Zoo Web Design. Done for the Memphis Zoo. A Gold Daddy Award goes to Bid Communications from Birmingham for Impetus Website Design. Done for their client, Impetus Construction. Fitzco in Atlanta wins a gold addy for French's Nil and Hinden Hooker. Done for French's. Fans are littering the field with objects from the stands, primarily in the south end zone, but his numbers of water bottles and debris all over the field. I mean, it is really a crazy scene when you look down there. Who brings a bottle of mustard? The top story in college football, mustard. Tennessee fans are fucking crazy. French's became the talk of college football overnight. We showed up at baseball games, in YouTube videos, even on babies. So we return to the 2022 season with a tang. This NIL deal for Hendon Hooker might be the best one yet. We teamed up with Tennessee's biggest star on their biggest game of the season and showed our support with some classic yellow drip. Fans ate it up. Hendon Hooker has a mustard deal and Tennessee fans are drinking it up. Media 2. French's commissioned a pair of mustard-inspired sneakers. We turn a bottle on a field into an icon. Showing that even a little mustard can go all the way. Now, when fans think Tennessee, they think French's. From Knoxville, Design Sensory wins a Gold Addy Award for the Regal TikTok campaign, done for Regal Cinemas. Are you new here? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? This is the best day of your life, and I'm just gonna let you continue to have it. Y'all, I was supposed to go to Target. <laughs> I don't know how I ended up here. Popcorn combos you have to try. Whole hot dogs past the mustard. It's a really solid question. Uh, the answer is uh, very deep, but the answer is no.
two Gold Addy Awards go to MWB from Jacksonville for civil rights cinematography and civil rights music done for Visit Mississippi. Shine a light, shine a light, every day and night. Look how we made it this far, this far. No, we can't forget who we are. Where we've been, what we've seen. No, we can't give up on the dream. So keep shining, keep shining yeah, on, keep shining. yeah, keep shining, yeah, keep shining, yeah, keep shining. Yeah, keep shining. Oh, oh. BBDO Atlanta wins for Nutcracker, done for the Georgia Lottery. Hey, big guy. Got a little holiday something for you. Tonight. Got what you want. Here you go. Oh, oh, oh. I'm the only one who is feeling blue at Christmas. Snow is falling in my heart. I'm so cold. Hey, I saw you were home and, well, thought you might like this. Happy holidays. everyone wants to get. Give the Holiday Scratchers from the Georgia Lottery. From Chattanooga, Humanot wins two Gold Addy Awards for the world's best kids. Done for Halo Pets. Halo makes the world's best food for the world's best kids. No, not that kid. This kid. They're 100% your child, but they don't act like one. You can leave this kid alone for 10 minutes and they won't destroy your house. Yeah! Yeah, but this kid dinner never ends up on your face. Really? And shopping never ends in tears. Ezra, 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 please. Which kid would you rather go on a road trip with? Ah! Yeah, we thought so. Can you watch your favorite shows with your human child? No! Maybe being a human parent is overrated. So keep talking in that voice that's 12 octaves too high. It's your guilt, Mr. Papa. It's your guilt. Go ahead and celebrate each one of their healthy poops. And feed them Halo, made with natural, high-quality ingredients, rooted in science for their best health and happiness. <laughs> Halo, the world's best food for the world's best kids. Tombras from Atlanta wins three Gold Eddie Awards for Guy on a Buffalo Wing, done for Zaxby's. One day the guy on the buffalo wing was riding around in a forest. Smell the smell. He's thinking, where's that smell coming from? Feels like maybe over there. So he moseyed on over, pulled back on the reins. That's how you stop a buffalo wing. And he hopped on off and he looked. Enough, I'll just let him go. I'll ah, see you, little fella. And then he found a hedgehog jammed down in a log and pulled him out, and they became best friends. They went back to 
the buffalo wing to snack down those XBs, but the food was gone. That snake and fox stole our meal. Oh, but you know what? I got I got an idea, says the hedgehog. I got something stashed in an old stub. Oh, oh, it's a buffalo garlic glazed meal. That's what I was just eating. Oh, it's tantalizing. Let's sit down and eat it. Mmm, that's pretty good. Got the buffalo wing. Well, if it isn't the chicken wing. Sorry, man, I'm a fox. It's kind of my thing. Truce? Ah, come here, man. We're cool. Oh, it's a guy on a buffalo wing. Hey, uh, guy. I don't remember it happening like that. Yeah, I don't either. Every time he eats Zaxby's, that's all he wants to talk about. Yeah, I saw the original, and it was definitely a buffalo you were riding, not a buffalo wing. Guy on a buffalo wing. And now, a look at some of our Silver Addy Award winners. First Judge's Choice Award goes to BBDO Atlanta from Atlanta Ad Club for Nutcracker, done for Georgia Lottery. Hey, big guy. Got a little holiday something for you. Tonight. Got what you want. Here you go. Hey, I saw you were home and, well, thought you might like this. Happy holidays. the gift everyone wants to get. Give the Holiday Scratchers from the Georgia Lottery. AAF North Alabama's The Library Of wins the next Judge's Choice Award for Black History is Church History, done for Worthy Redeemer Church. All my life, I've been told that Christianity is the white man's religion, that the scriptures were forced on black people from the slave masters. Lies. That the rhythmic, melodic, energetic style of preaching you might experience at the black church is inferior and really just a performance. Lies. That black people don't care about global missions. Lies. You see, God is truth. And God loves truth. So truth matters. And because the truth matters, we're going to deal with some of these lies and more. Because black history is church history. <laughs> Alexander Wade, lead teaching pastor of Worthy Redeemer Church. Join us on Saturday, February 26th, and learn the truth.
The next Judge's Choice Award goes to Intermark Group in Birmingham for the Alabama Tourism Mind Trip Campaign, done for the Alabama Tourism Department. Welcome to this guided hypnotic trip to the beautiful Alabama outdoors. Today, we're going to hike in Little River Canyon, Alabama. You're feeling more and more relaxed. The relaxation spreads down your neck, shoulders, and all the way down your arms to your fingertips. You may feel a tingling sensation in your fingertips, and your arms are growing heavy as you soon become aware of the peacefulness inside you. You're completely relaxed from the top of your head to the tips of your toes. And you see the outside world fade more and more into the background as you begin this journey. Imagine your hiking boots touching the soft ground on a trail in Little River Canyon, Alabama. As you hike farther along the trail, you hear the sound of water carving through the rocks. You dip your hands into the cool to the touch flowing river and feel it rejuvenate as you splash your sun-drenched face. You look up to the deep blue sky and see the tree leaves moving with the wind, creating a soothing ensemble of sound. You slowly gain altitude with every step as you hike higher and higher up the trail and you hear birds singing about the beauty of this place. As you walk farther up, you begin to hear the roar of water descending over a cliff. The rushing water sound gets louder with each step you take. And now you take in a magnificent waterfall. Through all of your senses, you, you taste the sparkling water's mist. You hear its roar. You feel its power. You take in the beauty of this place. You keep hiking higher to the rim. The path gets steeper. And you reach and place your hand on a cool rock to get a firm grip as you climb up a rocky section of the trail. Your eyes take in a breathtaking overlook. You see miles and miles of trees, rivers, and canyons. And now it's time to bring this experience, this journey to an end. Ask yourself what feelings and thoughts did you enjoy the most? And continue this feeling when you awaken. Counting from one to five now. Everything returning to normal one. All faculties returning to beginning to stretch your body. Three, four, and five eyes open, wide awake. Now, did you enjoy your mind trip? I imagine you'll want to visit Alabama for real so you can take it all in, in person. Close your eyes and relax. Take a deep breath and empty all of your thoughts. Now. Imagine you are hiking in Little River Canyon, Alabama. You feel the soft ground beneath your feet. You hear water trickle through the rocks. You see the sun weave through the trees. Now it's time to come back. Not yet. I still have a few miles of trail left. Welcome to this guided hypnotic trip to the sugar white sands of the Alabama Gulf Coast. You're feeling more and more relaxed. The relaxation spreads down your neck, shoulders, and all the way down your arms to your fingertips. You may feel a tingling sensation in your fingertips and your arms are growing heavy. And soon you become aware of a growing peacefulness inside you. You're completely relaxed from the top of your head to the tips of your toes. And you see the outside world fade more and more into the background as you begin this journey. Imagine that you're now standing on the sugar white sands of the Alabama Gulf Coast. See this in your mind's eye and make it a vivid mind experience. You're walking on the sand. You can feel the warmth of the sun on your skin. You hear the sound of waves lapping onto the shore. You see the water shimmer and sparkle in the distance. And as you walk down the beach, you can catch the faint smell of the salt bloom in the breeze coming from the gulf. 
You hear the distant sounds of birds calling faintly. As you marvel at the deep sense of calmness and tranquility that sweeps over you. It's so peaceful. And you can hear the wind mingling with the sound of the waves. You continue walking on the beautiful shoreline of the beach. And as you stroll lazily on the water's edge, you feel the coolness on your feet. As you wander, leaving a lazy trail of footprints behind you. And ever so often, a larger than usual wave surrounds your feet. You take it all in with all your senses. The smell of the ocean. The sound of the water kissing the sand. You get a small taste of the salty mist in the air. You see the largest, fluffiest, whitest clouds you've ever seen drift near you. You smell, see, hear, feel, and simply relish this experience and the joy it brings to your mind. And now it's time to bring this experience, this journey to an end. As I count from one to five, everything returning to normal, one, all faculties returning, two, beginning to move around some, stretching your body, three, four and five, eyes open wide awake. Now, did you enjoy your mind trip? I imagine you'll want to visit Alabama for real so you can take it all in, in person. Close your eyes now. I want you to relax, breathe deep. Imagine that you were walking on the Gulf shores of Alabama. You hear the birds off in the distance. You see cool waves splash on the shore. You feel the sugar white sand between your toes. Now, let's come back to reality. I don't want to come back. Bunton in Nashville takes home the next Judge's Choice Award for Black Abbey Patron Saints, done for Black Abbey Brewing. Today, we drink to St. Brittany, the patron saint of bathroom besties, the booster of confidence, the complimenter of clutches. She is the ultimate sister from another mister. Tales of her support are whispered in the never-ending line to the women's restroom. Men are perplexed, but they do not know that each new bestie gets her full attention and a mirror selfie that resembles that of a Baroque masterpiece. Hashtag Baroque bitches. Follow her angelic sound. Yacht queen! And know that Brittany is there waiting for you by the hand dryers. Black Abbey, created, not made. Today we drink to Saint Gary, the patron saint of the Irish goodbye. Oh, he goes by many names. Casper, Mr. Invisible, the guy on the milk carton. But to many, he is simply Gary. One moment, he's the life of the party. The next, he's gone. Oh, don't believe him when he says, I'll be RB, for his decision has been made. Some say he ghosted his own birth. Others say he was never there. But enjoy his company, because his presence is a present. And when he's gone, he's gone. You probably won't realize it for a solid 20 Hey, where's Gary? He is Saint Gary, the patron saint of the Irish goodbye. Black Abbey, created, not made. Today we drink to Saint Larry, the patron saint of Hold My Beer. He might not be the brightest, but what he lacks for in brains he makes up for in marbles. When he's not throwing a flying elbow onto a ping-pong table, he's turning holders of his beer into believers. Some say they've seen him walk on water. Others say it was an epic belly flop. But if you ever find yourself asking, what would Larry do? Just know, it's 
probably not a good idea. Hey, watch this! Over there! Black Abbey created, not made. Fat Happy in New Orleans wins a Judge's Choice Award for You Tense Soul, done for Covenant House, New Orleans. An image of a homeless person is a stereotype. What people think when they see homeless, cardboard, ripped up clothes, they think you mindless, like, like a mindless zombie. Do I look homeless to you? I ain't had nowhere else to go, so I slept under the bridge. Basically, I was a person sleeping in a wild day. That's what it felt like. I was a person sleeping in a wild. When you wake up in the morning in your own bed, in your own house, you'll be starting over on a new journey of your life. With them. As a person, you gotta change yourself. You just can't expect change to come to you because ain't nothing gonna change. As I travel bold through a portal of my proportion, no, don't give me a proportion of happiness. The next Judge's Choice Award goes to Tombris in Atlanta for Guy on a Buffalo Wing, done for Zaxby's. One day the guy on the buffalo wing was riding around in a forest. Smell the smell. He's thinking, where's that smell coming from? Feels like maybe over there. So he moseyed on over, pulled back on the reins. That's how you stop a buffalo wing. And he hopped on off and he looked in the bush and he saw the warm golden glow of a buffalo garlic blaze meal from Zaxby's. Oh, I'm going to take this with me to go. <laughs> it's great. Wouldn't it be good with some range? Go! Oh, thanks, Eagle. Oh, no, you don't want to ask too many questions, but it's a guy on a buffalo. Saw a fox in the weeds He's thinking that fox seems shady No, he's probably harmless enough I'll just let him go uh, See you, little fella And then he found a hedgehog Jammed down in a log And pulled him out And they became best friends They went back to the buffalo wing To snack down those Xbies But the food was gone That stinking fox stole a meal Oh, but you know what? I got, I got an idea, says the hedgehog I got something stashed in an old stump Ooh. Oh, it's a buffalo garlic glazed meal. That's what I was just eating. Ooh, it's tantalizing. Let's sit down and eat it. Mmm, that's pretty good. Guy on a buffalo wing. Well, if it isn't the chicken wing thief. Sorry, man, I'm a fox. It's kind of my thing. Truce? Ah, come here, man. We're cool. Oh, it's a guy on a buffalo wing. Uh, guy, I don't remember it happening like that. Yeah, I don't either. Every time he eats Zaxby's, that's all he wants to talk about. Yeah, I saw the original, and it was definitely a buffalo you were riding, not a buffalo wing. Guy on a buffalo wing.
And our final Judge's Choice Award goes to DCA in Memphis for Paradox at Pico branding campaign done for their client, Paradox at Pico. And now let's take a look at the rest of the Professional Addy Award winners. Sequitar Cinema in Nashville wins a gold Addy for Moon Pie Sunbad. Done for Moon Pie. Are you done with the sun? Then you need... Sunbad sunscreen. Get yours before it's gone, or at least before the sun destroys us all. S-P-F-U. Moon Pie Sunbad sunscreen. Available in stores and online. Can we eat this? No, you can't. Fitzko from Atlanta wins a gold daddy for We Care When They Can't. Done for Med Express. This swing doesn't care about your daughter's recital. And this spider doesn't care about your big hiking trip. These things don't care if you fall or slip or catch a cold from some stranger's germs. They're just things. They can't possibly care. But we can. And at MedExpress, you can get convenient, affordable treatment when you need it. Because we care when they can't. Cedar Creative from Birmingham wins for Open Door Short Film, ABCH. Done for Alabama Baptist Children's Homes and Family Ministries. Hello. Hey, Ann. This is Rachel at ABCH. How are you today? Mm -hmm. I'm fine, thanks. Um, is this about Lucy? Is she okay? Is... No, ma'am. Lucy's back with her parents, and I'm happy to say they're doing really well. Oh, okay. That's wonderful. <laughs> yeah, I actually have a question about a little boy. Um, his name is Chris. Another placement? Yes, ma'am. That's my question. Anne, are you still there? I would love that. is just as much yours as any other, okay? Maybe you wanna come in and check it out? Jason Craig from AAF Augusta wins a Gold Addy Award for Papa Joe's Banjo BQ. Done for Papa Joe's Banjo BQ Music Festival. Rye whiskey makes the band sound better Makes your baby cuter Makes herself taste sweeter Oh boy! Rye whiskey makes your heart beat louder Makes your voice seem softer Makes the back room hotter Oh boy, my thoughts aren't good thoughts Boys, have I ever told you about the time I...
Fitzco wins another gold addy for Friday to Friday, done for checkers and rallies. Bunton from Nashville wins six Gold Addy Awards for the Sitgo Let's Go Together. Done for Sitgo. It's done, go. Go together. Go see what's waiting over the hill. Go together. Go soak up the small stuff and drink in the big stuff. Go marvel at the wonders of life. We're all getting going. We're all deciding where to go, but wherever we go, let's go together. Also from Nashville, Finn Partners wins a gold for Jack Daniel's Calendar Fishing, done for Jack Daniel Distillery. Creative Mammals from Atlanta wins a Gold Addy Award for the Atlanta Hawks Peach City Edition. Done for their client, the Atlanta Hawks. Welcome to the A, where deep roots support hard work. We bend, but never break, persevere, and never quit. We're always on the move and forever on the rise. This is ATL in constant motion. We're ballers ball. And icons are made. So we should class to the victors. We out muscle, out smart, and out hustle. Steady on the grind, the chip on our mind. We represent a homegrown passion that's second to none. Yeah, this goes out to the victors. Victors, 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 victors. Here, success grows and sweet dreams become reality. Shout it out. Shout it out. We're true to the game. Nothing can stop nothing us. Can true to our destiny. Together, nothing can stop nothing us. And true to Atlanta. Oh, oh, witness. Witness. Here we are the victors. Also from Atlanta, Bruner wins two Gold Addy Awards for Save the Heist, done for the Great Southern Wood Preserving and Yellowwood. For five star backyards, Yellowwood brand pressure treated pie. If it doesn't have this yellow tag, you don't want it. Atlanta's Wonderman Thompson wins for Shifting Threats, done for their client, U.S. Marine Corps Recruiting. The future is threatened by enemies often unrelenting, Great. Get these out of here. unexpected, and unpredictable. In the midst of an uncertain and evolving world, the need for Marines to defeat these shifting threats is critical. Enemy drone down. Because the need to ensure stability for our nation has never been greater. Sending coordinates now. When 
there are battles to win for America's future, there is one constant. Marines. The spinning group from Knoxville wins a gold for See Yourself in Sevierville, done for the Sevierville Chamber of Commerce. See yourself in Sevierville, Tennessee. Your Smokies start here. Copper Wing in Birmingham wins a gold addy for The Cut Trailer, done for Roten Productions. Buster Welch has said that cutting is more than a set of tricks, that it's an art, it's an expression of culture, and at the bottom, it's built on a philosophy of life. The philosophy of cow people who've lived and worked in the American West of another era. They were a people who believed in simplicity and personal integrity. Theirs was a culture whose music, poetry, painting, and literature were not highly refined. Their best art could be found in their work. When we see Buster and his horse gliding back and forth across the arena, we catch a glimpse of our own past and of Western art in the purest form. Boy, it's a pleasure to work cattle on my good cutting horse, to have that horse working with you and out and smarting that cow with you. It's a pretty thing to watch. Nothing, nothing ever compares to riding a cutting horse. We're riding the greatest equine athletes in the world. There's always a job on a ranch that you can only do with a horse. But when it comes to working this country, gathering these cows on the King Ranch in South Texas, you need a cutting horse. Ultimately, what you want to get to is to have a horse that you're riding that you basically don't have to do anything but put him in the right place. You're more or less a passenger because they can outthink you Buster feels that he can teach people about horsemanship and the values that go with that that he thinks are good for the world. So Buster came up with the idea, let's have a three-year-old futurity for these horses. Every year, you're going to see 400 to 600 brand new horses you've never seen show. It's like the gates opening at the Kentucky Derby. Everybody goes to maturity, you know, with high hopes and dreams, and they can be torn down or built up one night. Cutting, it's, it's a lifestyle that we treasure. It's a lifestyle that our entire country was built on. That's the lifestyle that Buster, and me, and everybody else don't want to see go away. You have to have great respect for a guy like Buster Welsh. What he has wanted to do and has done is to connect the past with the present. Today, the connection is still there. Wonderman Thompson in Atlanta takes home a gold for Sprite and Marvel Hall of Zero Limits, done for the Coca-Cola Company headquarters.
From Birmingham, Cayenne Creative wins a gold for the Deliberate Indifference Podcast. Done for WBHM. And our last gold addy of the night goes to Cedar Creative for Sala Survivor Story. Done for their client, safe in the panhandle. My first memories are hiding in closets, being stuffed under big comforters. There's so much confusion. It feels like being invisible. For me, sexual abuse and exploitation was from the beginning. These are my first memories in life. And now a look at the rest of the Silver Addy winners. Congratulations to all of the professional Addy winners. Now we'll take a look at the Mosaic winners. The first Mosaic Addy Award goes to Atlanta's Chemistry Agency for Spirit of 17, done for Atlanta United. You have like real life people out here changing your life. And they got to wait till they die to get a mural. Anyway. Atlanta United is a club built on grassroots and community. So much so that they retired the number 17 to honor the city, the supporters, and the trailblazers who drive the club and Atlanta forward. Too often, we wait to celebrate the change makers until after their time has passed. So we decided to celebrate them now, to sing the praises of today's unsung heroes. Cole has helped pay tuition for 30 graduating seniors. She's covered stories that impacted every Georgia and interviewed men and women who've made history. We immortalize 17 people putting in the work right now with murals in every neighborhood. You know, it's a good time to honor the people that are making history and putting in work for their community. The free 99 fridge started only two months ago and already it's helping the community. Baseball player CJ Stewart and his wife Kelly are the founders of the nonprofit organization LEAD. My love of the culture really inspired me to start all the organizations that I'm with. A lot of us don't really get into this for the, the data boys and the high fives and the pats on the back. So I appreciate Atlanta United for understanding or wanting to understand Atlanta culture. By doubling down on community efforts and highlighting the leaders doing the work, we created something that honors local heroes and brings attention to them now with 62.9 million impressions to date, cementing the legacies of these heroes while their work is still happening. Is it a full circle moment? Kind of feels like it, but we got a lot more work to do. You know, this is no gimmick. I really want people to win through entrepreneurship. It's always dope to like give people their flowers while they're here. This is the spirit of 17. Our second Mosaic Addy Award goes to MWB in Jackson for civil rights music done for Visit Mississippi.
Shine a light, shine a light, every day and night. Look how we made it this far, this far. No, we can't forget who we are, where we've been, what we've seen. No, we can't give up on the dream. So keep shining, keep shining on, yeah, keep shining, keep shining, yeah, keep shining on. This year's Best of Print Award goes to Finn Partners from Nashville for Jack Daniel's Bonded Series Kit, done for Jack Daniel Distillery. Fitzco from Atlanta takes home the Best of Digital Award for We Care When They Can't, done for their client, Med Express. This swing doesn't care about your daughter's recital. And this spider doesn't care about your big hiking trip. These things don't care if you fall or slip or catch a cold from some stranger's germs. They're just things. They can't possibly care. But we can. And at MedExpress, you can get convenient, affordable treatment when you need it. Because we care when they can't. This pool toy doesn't care if swimmer's ear sinks your vacation. It can't even float. It can't care. But we can. Find relief and caring treatment at your nearest MedExpress. We care when they can't. These roller skates don't care if you catch a curb. They're just skates. They can't care, but we can. For x-rays and more, find caring treatment at MedExpress. We care when they can't. This spider doesn't care about your big hiking trip. It's just a garden spider, right? It can't care, but we can. Get the treatment and answers you need where and when you need it. We care when they can't. You think this iron cares if you have an interview today? It's an iron. It can't. But we can. From burns to sprains, get personalized treatment at MedExpress. We care when they can't. And the overall Best of Show Award goes to Fitzco from Atlanta for French's NIL with Hendon Hooker, done for French's. Fans are littering the field with objects from the stands, primarily in the south end zone, but these numbers of water bottles and debris all over the field. I mean, it is really a crazy scene when you look down there. Who brings a bottle of mustard? The top story in college football, mustard. Tennessee fans are fucking crazy. French's became the talk of college football overnight. We showed up at baseball games, in YouTube videos, even on babies. So we return to the 2022 season with a tang. This NIL deal for Hendon Hooker might be the best one yet. We teamed up with Tennessee's biggest star on their biggest game of the season and showed our support with some classic yellow drip. Fans ate it up. Media 2. French's commissioned a pair of mustard-inspired sneakers. We turn a bottle on a field into an icon, showing that even a little mustard can go all the way. Now, when fans think Tennessee, they think French's.
Congratulations to all of the winners in the 2023 District 7 American Advertising Awards competition. We hope you enjoyed this evening's presentation and look forward to seeing your award-winning work again next year. Copies of these videos along with an official winner's book will be posted to the District 7 website. Physical awards will be mailed to each local club for distribution. Thank you again for joining us this evening and good night.